Okay, today we'll be opening up this MicroGuard Select Oil Filter, number MSL57145, and this Beck Arley Oil Filter, number 041-8065. And I got these oil filters for free. Yep, a very generous viewer, whose name is Eric, from Pitts Grove, New Jersey, sent me these oil filters. Thanks, Eric. These oil filters fit Eric's 2007 Toyota Camry. Yep, the one with the 2.4 liter four cylinder engine. And these two filters are gonna duke it out. It could get ugly, folks. And when the dust clears, we'll see who the winner is. So let's get started. This is the network. You gotta glue the silicone. Be nice and tight. Get your hand up here. Filtration. Okay, let's start with the MicroGuard Select and we'll start with the box. This filter is rated for 10,000 miles. Look over here, thick steel canister, special powder coated paint. Look over here, synthetic resin media, traps up to 99% of contaminants, and that's at 25 microns. Silicone anti drain bag valve and gasket. A little picture here. Okay, let's, uh, oh, right here, made in Vietnam. All right, let's open up this box and see what this filter looks like. The date code, 21MHM038748. This is a sticker. It's got this little plastic covering over it. You can tell it looks like a silicone gasket, silicone and drain back valve. Metal core with holes, bypass valve down below. About four grooves there for threads. And it's got this like O-ring style gasket for threading that groove. Okay, let's look at the Beck and Arnley oil filter. And this filter here, it says, made in Korea. And that's about all the information on this box. There's nothing really else on here. So let's look at this filter. And the date code, H120822. This is all printed on. Filter size. And this one has a little tab here to pull out. It's got, also got the plastic coat. That off. This one looks like nitro rubber, anti drain back valve, metal core with holes, bypass valve down below. And there's about. Maybe three grooves there for threads. And also a nitro rubber. Well, this one's nitro rubber. The other one was silicone. But the same kind of style O-ring gasket. Fits inside of a groove there. No, it's on there really good. Yeah, it's right in there. Okay. All right, let's take these two filters. See the base plates? Eh. A little bit different. Yeah, let's take these two filters and open them up and see what they look like inside. Be right back. Okay, here they are cut open. Let's get their weights. The MicroGuard, 215 grams. The Beck and Arnley, 222.4 grams. And let's take a look at the gaskets. Put the measurements up on the screen. The Beck filter here is a little bit thicker thicker gasket but you got silicone versus the nitro rubber both probably do a good job base plates the Beck 82.2 grams the MicroGuard 87.9 grams take a look at them close you know the, the grooves on the threads there they look about the same I thought there was one less on the Beck filter, but no. Yeah, these guys both look pretty much the same. The holes are slightly bigger on the, the micro guard, but not by much. And any drain back valves, you got silicone for the micro guard, nitro rubber for the Beck.
Yeah, they both look like they did good, do a good job. Filter elements, the Beck filter, 64.5 grams. The MicroGuard, 63.1 gram. All right, let's uh, take a look at the MicroGuard. Got a metal crimp seam, and I counted 45 pleats. And I'm getting these specs off of O'Reilly's website. This is a synthetic blend filter media with a micron rating of 99% at particles 25 microns. Metal end caps, bypass valve right down here. Yeah, that all looks nice. Filter media looks nice. Nice and clean. Nicely spaced pleats. Okay, let's look at the Beck filter. Beck filter, also a metal crimp seam. And I counted 50 pleats, five more pleats. Metal end caps. Bypass valve down here. Whoops. I really couldn't find any information about this filter media. On Amazon's website, it says it's a synthetic media, but no micron rating. So you take that with a grain of salt. But yeah, nice and clean and uh, no excess glue. Both look nice. Now let's look inside the cans. MicroGuard, spring, and the Beck filter also spring, pretty big one. Let's check out the cans. The Beck filter weighs 58.4 grams for the can, and the MicroGuard, 52 grams for the can. Let's get their measurements. I was getting about 0 0.48, 0.50 millimeters. It's a pretty thick can. And the Beck filter, 6. 0.58 millimeters, 0.57 millimeters for the can. A little bit thicker. And the filter meters. This is the MicroGuard. 2.10 inches wide. The Beck filter. 1. Point, let's go, just call that 1.8. 1.8 inches wide. Yeah, there's a little bit of size difference here, but you got five extra pleats over here. Depends how deep the pleats are also. Yeah, so let's uh, cut these two filters open, stretch them out. Let's see what they look like. Be right back. Okay, here they are stretched out. And the MicroGuard oil filter is 43 and a half inches long. And the Beck and Arnley filter is 53 and a half inches long. Okay, so let's get the thickness on these guys. The MicroGuard oil filter is 0.81 millimeters thick. And the Beck filter is 0.58 millimeters thick. It's quite a bit thinner. And you'll be able to see that also in the microscope picture. This is a filter inside, back side. You'll see some light spots. Whereas the the micro guard looks like it'd do a better job of filtering. Now let's take a look at that picture right now. So you can see a few light spots in the Beck and Arnley oil filter compared to the micro guard oil filter, which looks pretty solid. And let's take a look at the rest of the filter. So we got the gaskets, uh, you know, you got silicone versus nitro rubber. The nitro rubber is thicker, so I don't know, maybe it's like a tie. Right here, I'd give this to, this, to the micro guard because it's a silicone and drain back valve. I would give the inlet holes a tie too in the 
threads and everything else, the base plates that tie. Both got holes there. They're nice smooth holes also, so they're both the same. Same in that respect. Coil springs, pretty much the same. The cans, can is slightly thicker on the Beck and Arnley oil filter. But there is a price difference. The MicroGuard costs like twice as much. So what do you guys think about these two filters? And again, I want to thank Eric for sending me these two oil filters. And I also want to mention Eric has a YouTube channel called Tech Time with Eric. He has computer related info on his channel. I'll put a link down below. So with that being said, I think I'll wrap this video up. And don't forget, Oil Filter Fridays, I try to open up an oil filter every Friday on this YouTube channel. So if you like this video, please hit that like button. Thanks for watching and take care. The MicroGuard filter media weighs 15.2 grams. The Beck and Arnley filter media weighs 10.6 grams.